NFC East is getting a shake up today. Because earlier, the Eagles, they released Darius Slay after not being able to find a trade partner with him and not being able to reconstruct his contract. They were like, all right, Slay, it's not you, it's us. We, we just need some bread right now. The Eagles, they, they lost a lot of people this offseason. Um, and now the Cowboys. And this is one that has been talked about, I feel like, for the past couple of years that people felt like this could happen really at any time. But now it's official. The Cowboys are releasing Ezekiel Elliott. And that's big. Now, of course, they did put the franchise tag on um, on Tony Pollard, who's, who's a nice running back, too. He's been definitely emerging over these past couple of years, and, and he got that burst. And they, a lot of people feel like Ezekiel Elliott slowed down. They feel like he ain't the same running back that he used to be. Um, but the Cowboys, they kept hanging on to him and hanging on to him and hanging on to him. But they finally decided, you know what? That's a wrap. We're done. We, we, we can't do it anymore. We're not going to do it anymore. So as far as the money part, um, Adam Shafter broke it down. He said, by designating Ezekiel Elliott, Ezekiel Elliott as a post-June 1st cut, the Cowboys will save $10.9 million in salary cap space with five point eight in dead money. Uh, his contract will stay on the books until then, but he's free to sign with a team at any time. So he, he's a free agent. He'll be a free agent uh, once they officially make this move. Now, the five point eight in dead money, with it being a post-June 1st cut, um, then I believe that they would be splitting that 5.8 mil in dead money uh, on into two years. That would be this year, put it, half of it on this year's cap and half of it on next year's cap if it's a post-June 1st cut. Um, unless, unless that 5.8 mil in dead money is half of what the dead money is when they cut Ezekiel Elliott. So... I'm not sure exactly what the deal is with that. So if y'all know, please put it in the comment section so you can enlighten all of us so we can have a clear understanding of exactly what the dead money is. But either way, regardless what the dead money is, what the alive money is, Ezekiel Elliott is 